Today, we are going to be discussing the Hittites, an ancient civilization that was once a major power in the ancient world. But before we dive into who they were and where their kingdom was located, let's first take a step back and look at the context in which the Hittites existed. The Hittites were a group of people who lived in the ancient Near East, a region that encompassed modern-day Turkey, Iraq and the Levant. This region was home to many different civilizations and empires over the course of its history, including the Akkadians, the Sumerians and the Babylonians. The Hittites were just one of many cultures that flourished in this part of the world. So who were the Hittites and where was their kingdom located? The Hittites were of a Indo-European origin who spoke a language known as Hittite. They were believed to have migrated to the region of Anatolia, modern day Turkey, around 2000 BCE. From there, they established a kingdom that stretched from the eastern Mediterranean coast all the way to the Black Sea. The Hittite kingdom was located in a strategic location with both access to land and sea trade routes. This gave the Hittites a significant advantage over their neighbours, allowing them to become a major economic and military power in the region. The Hittites were known for their advanced military technology, including the use of iron weapons and chariots. They were also skilled diplomats using treaties and alliances to secure their places in the region. This helped them to establish a large and powerful kingdom that included many different peoples and cultures. The Hittite kingdom reached its peak of power in the 16th century and 15th century BCE, during the time of the Hittite king, Hutusali. Under his rule, the Hittites expanded their territory and defeated their rivals, including the powerful kingdom of Babylon. However, the Hittite kingdom was not immune to internal conflicts and invasions from outside forces. In the 13th century BCE, the Hittites were attacked by the Sea People, a group of barbarian invaders from the Mediterranean. Despite the best efforts, the Hittites were unable to stop the Sea People and their kingdom began to decline. By the 12th century BCE, the Hittites had lost control over much of their territory and their power significantly declined. They continued to exist as a civilization for a few more centuries, but they were no longer the dominant force they once were. Despite their eventual decline, the Hittites left a lasting legacy in the ancient world. They were one of the first civilizations to use iron weapons, which revolutionized warfare and paved the way for the development of ironworking in the ancient world. The Hittites were also known for their sophisticated legal system, which included the use of treaties, contracts to govern relations between different states and individuals. This concept of international law would later be adopted by other civilizations and is still in use today. In addition to their military and legal contributions, the Hittites also made significant contributions to the field of art and architecture. The Hittites were skilled stone carvers and their palaces and temples were adorned with intricate carvings and reliefs. The Hittites may not be as well known as some of the other ancient civilizations, but their contributions to the ancient world cannot be overlooked. They were a powerful and influential civilization that left a lasting mark on history. Thank you for watching and listening to our videos. Be sure to like, comment and subscribe if you've enjoyed. All sources are listed and linked in the description below. I've been the Ancient History Guy, and as always, I'll be seeing you later.